coming with Bob. Let's have a few brews. Let's have some fun with the bum wine crew. So kick your feet up and grab you a beer. Cause damn man, I'm glad that you're here. All right, all right, all right. This is Bum Wine Bob. Wait to an all new edition of Bum with Bobcat on Premier Podcast Network and on the Bum Wine Bob YouTube channel. So, cheers to everybody out there. Happy Easter. If you're out there listening to us on Easter Sunday or after, either way, hopefully you had your your Easter hams or your, your ham uh, ready to go. But we are here with a quick shot. A bum with Bobcat here this week. So cheers. As the 2024 Battle of the Booze tournament is in full swing, as we are getting ready to tip off the final four action of this year's tournament, it's coming down to the wire, everybody. So be sure to get out there and vote for your favorites in the tournament because it's some hot action out there but before we get into who advanced to the final four in the battle of the booze we are still celebrating this week the new bump wine of the week it is right here the md 2020 spiked sweet taste smooth finish hard bite the new kid on the block the as you can see or here right there the red grape wine which we have featured as the bumwinebob.com bum wine of the week and getting some traction out there as people are starting to come across it find it because if you've seen by now there's been a lot of talk of MD2020 in the the internet news the TikToks the Instagrams the YouTubes of the uh, the younger generation finding out about the world of MD2020 and their reaction videos, which people have been tagging me constantly and saying, hey, did you see this? Uh, do you know about this? And, and, and somebody brought this up to me, I guess, a few weeks ago after the first video was posted saying, look, they're, they're discovering MD2020 and people are out there doing reaction videos, replying to it. And then tagging me saying, hey, and I'm saying, hey, look, we were doing this here on the website for 10 years uh, and years prior to that. We've been doing it before it was posted on the Internet. So if you're stumbling across this video because of tagging MD2020 in the YouTube feeds of the world, then stick around and head over to bumwinebob.com where we have the best of the worst in cheap booze and give the bum wine bob youtube channel a follow as we keep trying to grow the brand there but yes we did name these new spiked the bum wine of the week as we keep that train rolling this week and since we're doing a a shorter solo episode this week as a special treat for the listeners on the Bumming with Bobcat podcast feed. Uh, Once I am done with my little spiel here today with this and the final four reveal, stick around my appearance on Uncle the Podcast from a few weeks ago where we cracked this open for the very first time. I will be playing that in the feed here today. So we'll just give it, you know, third time to charm, right? We did it once with Uncle. We did a second try, a redemption with Roadhouse, and this here, right now, we're doing a solo here, MD2020, spiked. Not bad, not bad, still still not bad. Uh, I put the clips out there this past week of the part one and part two of the taste test of this, and... Not, not bad, not bad. It, it's sweet. It's a red wine, but definitely something drinkable. So, 
sweet taste, smooth finish. Hard bite. Where is it? Right there. MD2020 spiked. Right there. The bumwinebob.com. Bum wine of the week. As you can see, right there. See? Right there. There it is. MD2020 spiked. 20% alcohol. Going back to the roots of the original MD2020s. So if it's in one of the test markets near you, check it out. Give it a shot. Spend a few bucks. You can't really go wrong uh, for the price. So we'll wash it down with a little more, little more hams here. And hopefully you have your uh, Easter hams ready. And if you're listening to this after Easter, hopefully you enjoyed a nice Easter ham. Just like this one here. And also not to be confused with my ham from earlier this year or Christmas, whenever that was. I thought I had the picture up still, but uh, I guess I, I don't. But either way, happy Easter. And thanks for tuning in to the Sunday sermon, the Easter Sunday sermon with the Reverend Bum Wine Bob, you know, the officiant of the high life right here. Wherever my high life can is hiding somewhere right here. There it is. Miller High Life, the champagne of beers, which is still alive and well in the 2024 bumwinebob.com Battle of the Booze Tournament. So let's reveal that bracket here, as you can see, or if you're listening along with us, that going into the, the Crazy 8 round, we had Miller High Life against Coors Banquet Beer. And that's a tough matchup, but it was the High Life that pulled out the victory. And then down in the, the Bum Wine region, we had Thunderbird Wine against the MD2020 Orange Jubilee. And the Dirty Bird snuck one out over the MD2020 as Thunderbird advances to the Final Four. And then on the other side of the bracket, Old English 800 beats out Mickey's Fine Malt Liquor to advance once again to the Final Four. And then in the Battle of the Locos, Four Loco Jungle Juice against Four Loco Gold, who is the new kid on the block, the Four Loco Jungle Juice that advances to the Final Four. So you have two big... Big, 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 big time matchups here in the final four of Old English 800 versus Four Loco Jungle Juice and Miller High Life versus Thunderbird Wine. So, one of these four right here that you can see will it be last year's champion, Old English 800 Malt Liquor, the new kid on the block. Four Loco Jungle Juice, the 2020 winner, Miller High Life, or the the American Classic, which Roadhouse and I were talking. We said we did the Dirty Bird a few months back. Could this be the Dirty Bird redemption story? Is this the year that Thunderbird finally makes it to the top, that one of the OG classic bum wines can be the champion and could that championship parlay itself into a possible return of the dirty bird to store shelves you never know gallo wines gets word that thunderbird wine is the champion maybe they kick that back into production you never know you never know crazier things have happened out there so be sure to get out there and vote once the polls open stay tuned to battletheboos.net for voting tell your friends spread the word we got two more two more rounds to go the final four then the finals this week and then we will have our 2024 battle of the booze champion so stay tuned for that be sure to tell your friends to get those votes in you want to see one of your favorites win vote it's free spread the word share like subscribe 
to the YouTube channel. Just just spread the word. That's all we're saying here. Just spread the word that the best of the worst in cheap booze is at bumwinebob.com. And I'm bumming with Bobcat. As we said, that the MD2020 is getting a lot of traction lately because of the kids these days cracking it open and giving it a try for the first time. But don't forget where you saw it. It was with us at bumwinebob.com. And don't forget that this guy right here, the MD2020 spiked, is your bumwinebob.com bum wine of the week. And Big Bark, Hard Bite, the Red Grape Wine. So so check it out. Tell your friends. Check out the website. Share. Subscribe. Rate, review the podcast on all your favorite podcast apps. As I said, we're just doing a, a quick little recap shot this week. And then the next time we should be with you guys is to reveal the 2024 battle of the booze champion and we might be doing a live episode for that one you never know so that's why you got to subscribe you got to subscribe to the bum one bob youtube channel it's free tell your friends to check it out and until next time cheers